Hi Libra, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, my name is Michelle and this is your soulmate twin flame weekly reading. Again, this is for my Libras who are in a soulmate twin, uh, twin flame connection. Of course, I want to remind you guys that my readings have no data, divinely guided, everything has free will. Not everything is going to be resonated with everybody. And of course, this is general readings. This is not a personal reading. So always keep in mind that you had to put your reality into this readings, okay? So with that said, let's take a look what's going on with your soulmate. Um, let's take a look. Also, I lost most of my nails. Awesome. So let's take a look what is your soulmate's messages for you. Let's see what they're not telling you. Let's take a look. Let's discover what they're not telling you. So, Libra. The first card says, thank you, Spirit, by the way. So, how rude I am. Stop ignoring me. I can take it. You are going to hear from them. Yes, pregnancy. Oh, my goodness. Um, but some of you could get pregnant with this person or have a kid with this per person. If it's not possible, this could also mean uh, like the Empress card. This could be a brand new beginning, a transformation as well. Um, the other one says, please don't forget me. Other one says, I drink to forget. Thank you, Spirit. We have, I know, it, I know it sucks, but perhaps it's time to move on. And two more. Okay, thank you, Spirit. We have, I know it's hard, but I'm willing to jump into the new if you do too. And then we have, last one, a, um, a cheater will be always a cheater. Red flags. And at the bottom here, I feel a lot of guilt for the way I acted and then the other one says don't be afraid of the storm and, and find shelter and I know you are taken yet you know you belong with me so yet again there's a lot of feelings here this is like a roller coaster of situations here this is your energies and theirs so here we have you maybe you have moved on maybe you have tried to move on you're either or in a, in a relationship or are getting to know somebody regardless of what the situation is they think you're not single anymore if you said something to them or if they saw something in social media and they decided that that meant that you were not available anymore again this is I'll take it however the best resonates for you um this person um has in the past this person you could have been in a relationship with them and they could have cheated on you or this person it's a bit of a player as well so you are telling yourself because the card that said a cheater is always a cheater comes from your energy mostly um this could be also a cross watcher situation um but either or you think this person cannot change or it's hard for you to believe that this person could change and that makes the situation a little bit more harsh a little bit more like difficult for you to maybe reach out to them or make things work with them but it's definitely a situation that you are telling yourself, it's maybe I should move on. But at the same time, you hold a little bit of hope of like hearing from them. And it's telling you right here that yes, they are tired of the silence. They are tired of you ignoring them. So they're going to be reaching out to you soon. Very, very soon. Let's take a quick look. Okay. What can you give me, Spirit, please and thank you about the situation with Libra and their twin flame? So we got the three of cups in reverse. There was a third party situation and that's over. Um, it most definitely, it could have been from your person side. We got the ten of swords, the five of coins in reverse, the two of wands, Sagittarius Leo energy, nine of wands, again, Leo Sagittarius, a lot of uh, fire. And then we got the six of coins. At the bottom, we got the four of wands and the sun in reverse so um if i go by color as well uh you could be dealing with a water sign as well earth sign and a fire as well so again uh capricorn taurus virgo as well as pisces cancer scorpio as well as like leo sagittarius maybe some of you you'll be dealing with that aries here so going back to the reading um there was a third party situation that maybe you did not know about or that is a situation that made this connection impossible or it helped this connection to not happen. Um, you felt very betrayed when you found out about it or when 
this got in the way and it did not let your relationship with them to develop to evolve uh, you feel very very betrayed I feel like this comes from your energy um, you felt very very heartbroken it's like you were not expecting it um, I think they were dealing with other people or talking to other people or messing around with other people behind your back uh, at the same time they were talking to you so that's one of the things that you got very upset and very sad about we got the five of coins in reverse and the two of ones right here um yes again this person was doing things behind your back you were not aware of you did not know about it and you were uh constantly waiting for a text or a communication or you were like hmm like are we gonna move forward like where is this gonna go ahead you know where is this headed or stuff like that and this person was not telling you much and it's because they were like legit in a re in a relationship like in a serious relationship or a long-term relationship you can name it however you want it they were not very very happy with it with the person they were about to end it they were um not i was gonna say screaming but i was gonna say arguing with them quite on a daily basis um with the two of ones right here they wanted to go towards you but they took forever to end this connection here and with the nine of ones right here you got tired of waiting and you decided to leave or to stop wasting your time in a way on this person and you maybe just decided to put yourself out there and you started to get to know people you started to talk to other people and stuff like that uh with the six of coins and the four of ones right here yeah you were actually you're a very beautiful libra and we know that libras are attractive you know venus and all that so we know that libras are we cute we cute you know so um yeah, you were actually exploring your options and all of that with other people and when the four on ones this person felt like you gave them their back that you gave them your back and that you were walking away and that you were actually like having a new beginning with somebody else and that with the sun made him or made her very very sad and reverse here very very um not optimistic about it um for some of you this person was gonna leave uh whoever they were with right away but they found out that you were like seeing somebody else going on a date date with somebody else and they um decided to stay with this person a little bit longer but they felt very very betrayed as well in in a weird way they felt very heartbroken and i'm not here to take sides like i tell everybody um people like to comment things that are unnecessary because i'm as honest as you can get like I'm not gonna take sides I'm gonna tell you how you feel or how you felt and I'm gonna tell you how they felt and then you take it from there that's my job nothing else so give me this card so temperance okay so this is divine timing you guys were separated most definitely it's been going on for a while it's been going on for a while I see that you haven't seen this person since 2019 for some of you um, and you said you have been waiting for a reunion uh, for some of you you want to get back together others of you you just want clarification here because twin flame and soulmates you know we know that not always not always they don't always get back together unfortunately but hey everybody deserves clarity right so what can you give me about their person how is this person feeling towards Libra as it right now can you give me a little bit more how is this person feeling or how do, do they feel towards Libra as it right now with the world here Taurus Virgo energy as well we got the nine of coins the four of coins the ace of ones the eight of ones in reverse and the queen of cups at the bottom here we got the magician air energy libra gemini and aquarius and then we have the nine of cups and the five of cups uh, of coins in the reverse sorry so let's see yes this confirms that you haven't seen this person in a while i don't know about uh something about pride month or about june right that they were going to reach out to you but they just like didn't um, this person has been watching you very closely on social media most definitely because I don't see this person communicating with you in a straightforward way like it's very very they're very very secretive they're very really uh, weird <laughs> um, but they have been watching you for a while 
specifically, especially since June. They've been watching you for a while because they have an intention. That it's like something is about to happen. It's like they're watching you because they're trying to gain courage to talk to you. With the nine of coins right here, they find you beautiful and attractive. Um, they actually find you too good for them in a way. Like they find you that you are too beautiful and too much for them. Um, with the four of coins right here, they come and come back with um, an attitude of like, oh, I have money or I, I had all of this success because they have been working very hard on their money on the side note and they want to impress you. They want to come back and impress you in a way. I'm not saying that you ever gave them a, um, a way of like, oh, you had to come back with money, but that is the way for them because they want to win you back, but at the same time, they want to impress you and the way that they feel that you're going to be impressed is with money, which I very doubt. With the Ace of Wands right here, no matter what, how much they deny, no matter how much of a dick they could be, you are the person that they want. You are the person that they try to forget with other people. You are the person that they're trying to replace with other people. Because if you were to see whoever they're dating or seeing, it's pretty much a lookalike of you. Not everybody, this is a specific message for somebody, your ex or this soulmate that we're talking about, they have a specific type and it's you. And they have, been, without knowing, they have been like looking and talking to people who are lookalikes of you. But the 801s right here, this person is very proud and they are not very good with words. They're not very, very good with words. And I gonna have, I know I'm going to have comments because I can see the future <laughs> about people like, how is this, if it's a soulmate, why can't you just reach out? And I'm I'm explaining to you that they are proud, okay? Like I cannot do anything besides telling you what's good. Like I cannot go to their house, chase them, and get them to talk to you just because you can't be patient. Like if you have no patience, then you're not have you have no patience, and that's fine. So just move on, right? But no, you want to just watch videos and be upset because patience is a virtue. It's, it's a gift not, that not everybody has. Not even myself. But that is the thing. This person is not very good with, with decisions, number one, with words and with actions. They're not very good at that. They're very close up. They're very close up. And they're wanting to, that's why they're going to come back maybe buying you a gift or buying you something or asking you out on a, an expensive date or something like that just to show you how they, they care, how they like you because they're not good with words. Like some people like me, we can speak for hours others they can't and that is the re that is the the situation with your person with the queen of cups right here this person wants you to marry okay they, they will like they the intentions right it's not just to to um to smash and leave right it's just to of course that but they want a really they want a relationship with you so the questions they're not knowing what what's good you will have closure, you will have a lot of things because they're coming forward, they're coming forward. But just be expecting, like, you cannot expect a person like a movie, like they're gonna sit down and just cry and giving you all the details of what happened. Yeah, they're gonna give you details, but they are very, very close up with emotions. They, it's gonna feel like they don't mean it in a way. Like when they say, I'm sorry, when they say, I love you, it's gonna feel like they don't mean it, but that's how they are. They're close up emotionally unavailable and they're trying their best to open up to you so we have to lower not lower the standards but your expectations are not their responsibility the same way their expectations of you it, it's not your responsibility to fulfill them we have to get me uh, meet our other person in the middle and work with what we got the same effort here the same effort here so just keep that in mind be the balance Libra you are the scale if it goes too high, somebody's giving too much. If it uh, goes the other way, somebody's giving too much too. Find the balance. You are the scale, Libra. Find the balance here. We have the magician in reverse. This person is not coming to lie to you. This person is not coming to come in and out of your life to play you. They're not doing that. Um, they are not, like I said, they're not very good with words. So do not expect like a whole like uh, essay. It's not happening. It's going to be little maybe messages through Facebook, through social media, through phone, right? But those messages, they mean a lot because they do care for you. They do love you. 
and they don't know they love you love you but they do freaking love you love you you know what i'm saying like they are very very attached to your energy and they haven't been able to forget you and they have even been drinking and partying or like doing a lot of things just to not think about you but it's not working because whenever they're sober i mean sober uh they can't they, they can't stop thinking about you the nine of cups and the five of coins in reverse they have dreams about you they have dreams about coming back to you everything they dream about is about you and it's about getting back to libra talking to libra before it's too late some of you can be a single parent libra and they also uh, wanted to come back right because if they weren't going to date you, they wanted to be the person that's going to be there for you and your kid. If you're pregnant or if you have kids with whomever, you know, not necessarily theirs. What is the outcome between Libra and this soulmate? Let's see. Ace of Swords. Oh my God, a really tough victory here. We got the eight of coins in reverse. We got the full, the eight of coins in reverse. So we got Aries energy, the chariot in reverse. I see a lot of red. This is a lot talking about your um, about heart, about emotions, like about passion, about chemistry. The four of cups and at the bottom here, we got the nine of swords um, in reverse and the devil Capricorn energy here. So this person is very, very, uh, sexually pa very passionate when it comes about sex they are very extremely attracted to you libra that is not even a doubt there's not a, even a, a thought of like they don't like you they they love you they're like so so attracted to you so they're coming back here with uh strong uh, actions with strong and determination because they want to win you back they want to win you over uh, this person is very very good at flirting they are an amazing flirt and if they're not an amazing flirt you feel like that you feel like they are an amazing flirt so they're coming back um, flirting and trying to have that touch of conversation of like no I'm gonna win Libra back and I'm gonna win Libra back my way so the full right here there's a new beginning it's something unexpected something that it was not legit planned or something that maybe you thought it was done said and done something that you thought like again it was not gonna happen and boom this person comes back again with a new beginning and like everything you thought you knew changes with the eight of coins right here and the chair right here in the reverse this cancer energy so you stop giving because you thought it was a waste of your energy because you thought it was a waste of your time and you thought it was not gonna get you anyway right but also the not trying any anymore on for from both of you it did not let neither of you move on from each other you know so you actually got stuck with their energies and the same way happened to them so um at this point they're going to uh talk to you because like i said there is a very emotional or very uh it comes from the heart they're gonna tell you that they knew that they did not take your offer and they did not take your efforts the way they should have and they know that this is a message um from your person here uh they knew that you tried so many times and you gave them what is most precious about somebody a human being that you can't take back which is time and you gave them your time you gave them your efforts your your wanting and all of that situation and this person did not do anything with it this person did ignore it and they regret that very very badly because regardless of you guys getting together or not they know that that was not the right thing to do to you or anybody with the four of cups right here they actually are very heartbroken over that this is a situation that they're going to talk about and this is a situation that they have been dreaming about and one of the things that they don't talk about not even with good friends because they know how shitty and how garbagey that move was and they don't feel very proud about it they feel very very upset about it I don't know about number four what's important for you guys uh, number four is important for you with the four of cups right here like I said there's a lot of drinking here a lot of drinking and sleeping on their side because they feel very very sad because this separation has gotten in under their skin at this point with an nine of swords right here um, and the devil right here so again they would like to erase the damage that it caused of course i have people who will tell me the past is the past and it's like 
hello, duh, right? But the thing is that people, some people deserve second chances, and I'm not giving you like, oh, this person deserves second chances, but they want a second chance, and I, what I'm seeing here, they want to earn that second chance, you know? And I see you being doubtful, and but I still see you giving them a chance, because look at that, the devil right here. This person has been on your tail all this time. This person has, it's like they, they follow you everywhere. They, they haven't let you alone. This person sees you as their girlfriend, their boyfriend. I know that's crazy because of the way that they acted, because of how the situations are right now. But this person sees you as their girlfriend, boyfriend. It's like, don't fuck with my girl. Don't fuck with my man. You know, like that's how they feel towards you they have been showing you your pictures to, to people to friends and they go like when their friends go like mm, that that's cute like or or they're good looking they get upset they go like hmm don't do that with my girl don't do that with my man you know so they have not stopped looking at you they have not stopped wanting you uh, they look at your profile all the time at your photos all the time and they go like crazy about it they go like mm -mm -mm. libra is getting good looking by the minute you know so be expecting them to come back. Be expecting them to reach out. I feel like they're gonna be reaching out on like around nighttime. It's gonna be a very late uh, text message, um, and it's gonna be surprising for you. But it's gonna be a very late text message for you. And um, this is a it could be a reunion, but I also feel like this this could be a little bit of a distance in between you two, like physical distance. So you guys will have to talk a little bit more first before meeting or seeing each other because again i see like there is um distance in between you and them so i feel like you guys are going to be talking a little bit here and there and then you guys are going to plan on seeing each other so there is a lot of talking and a lot of like planning and a huge possibility of meeting so if you thought this was over it is not over um there is a comeback from their part and from there you decide what to do right let's see what is the overall energy here we got three so we got strength strength release and joy the strength card says don't let weeds and this wait don't let weeds and thistles cultivate in your garden i was gonna say testicles i was like that's what i thought he said i was like then joy it says uh, make time for the little things today and then release it says lighten your load so these are little messages the overall overall energy so pretty much release let go of the past let let go of the old patterns and let go of like worries and situations that we cannot control joy live laugh and love just like the freaking things that we see on target um pretty much just enjoy that today with friends and family you deserve it and strength courage because it is a comeback and even though that i know that some of you don't want this person back just enjoy it and thanks the universe for the things because there is always a reason behind it and i know people hate it but people hate on everything nowadays like people hate happiness people hate sadness people hate people who care people hate people who don't care so at this point i'm gonna tell you just be you do not let nobody stop you things will happen when they should happen and yes it is a comeback keep on manifesting libra because this is not over in between you and your soulmate so i don't care what people say i'm right and that's all you need to know because you girl you boy this is not over it's about to start so you guys thank you so much for watching me thank you so much for subscribing and supporting my channel i also have a facebook a facebook group that i just created so if you guys want to follow me there is um la baby witch tarot so it's going to be the same name on their this account um and you will see my face just send the if you want to follow me there or be part of the group just go ahead and you will be automatically accepted by me i always talk to people i'm always very active on my social media so hey it'll be nice to have you guys there too so thank you so very much and bless me bye love you guys